of bread. I'm all packed up. I even uh, packed out a half a loaf of bread. With some peanut butter and marshmallow club spread. Well, I'm, so I'm pretty spent. Back to back 30s. Didn't eat a lot yesterday. Just ate a rotisserie chicken in like five minutes. Still kind of hungry. So I should probably uh, get moving here in a bit. Tired. I want to go at least like 11, 12 miles. If I'm feeling motivated, 18. It's 12.30 now in Rangeley, Maine. The most expensive resupply yet. Out of 2,000 miles. Out of, excuse me, I would say a, out of the whole Triple Crown. This is the IGA in Rangeley. Has the most expensive resupply. They had meat packets, 88 cent meat packets for 329. A pack of Oreos was seven dollars. Yeah, anyways. 200 and something miles left to Mount Katahdin. Just wanna fucking get there. Didn't even have to get my thumb out in Rangeley. I sat down at the IGA, scarfed down a rotisserie chicken, bag of donuts and two tall cans of beer. And I had one older lady offer me a ride. I said, no, thank you. I appreciate it. I got to take care of some shit. I don't know if I said that, but um, then another gentleman came up to me that was on his way to the hiker hut. And I do not recall, I forgot your guys' names, so thank you so much if you see this for offering to give me a ride. So I got back on trail, uh, I was kind of dragging, got a cup of coffee in me and a peanut butter marshmallow spread sandwich I packed out. Feeling a little bit better, but um, just going slow, taking her easy a day. Going to do a 10 mile Nero and then 21 miles to Stratton, where I guess the hostel of Maine, and I think it's called the Roadhouse. I'm not sure if that's in Monson, but I know the hostel of Maine is a pretty cool place, so I'm probably gonna take a zero. I need it. Um, other than that, beautiful weather, rain got blown out of the forecast, so I got like four or five days of nice weather. Um, some 80 degree weather coming in, so. Everything's looking fucking shabby to uh, Summit Katahdin here in uh, probably the next 10 days. It's been real swampy, plenty of uh, log crossings, plenty of mud. Don't fall on that. Sinking logs. And then plenty of roots and rocks. So it's not the uh, easiest little cruise, but I'm fucking getting there. A warm shelter brings the heat. Back mountain, and then I got uh, the horn, and then one other peak following that, and then I will be going downhill to a little shelter. Nice, I didn't think uh, it's gonna get more alpine. yesterday I'm making my way up and there are tons of south bounders it's like a flood like the gates have opened 
back in fucking Georgia. I haven't seen a lot of absurd backpacks though. I think Southbounders have a little bit more grip on what they're doing out here. Warm shelter brings the heat. Pushing fucking miles. Bring your spirits right back up. I was dragging off a rotisserie chicken, a couple tall cans. Yeah, I feel like I've been fucking high off life all day. Downhill. I'm definitely gonna take the climb on this shit. I was just about to walk down this and then I thought for a sec wow I'm just climbing this with no judgment because I'm just starting to get used to it but this is how it's been on a lot of the uphill and downhill um, I'd say since New Hampshire and it's got progressively worse not any better but it ain't nothing Almost 2,000 miles in on this jaunt. But uh, getting a little 10 mile narrow in today. Had a nice hike with cast iron and M&M. Good morning. Sun popped out for a second. Now the overcast. Should break up here in a couple hours. And I got like a nice little ridge. And a couple 4,000 footers. 
I'm just taking my time. I kind of want to have a view when I get up there. <laughs> I just want to blow through it. It's been real nice, nice alpine hiking, but uh, in between it's been pretty rough with rocks and roots and mud and whatnot. So it's a grind in between the alpine, but um, be getting into uh, the hostel of Maine today. I'm gonna take a zero, much needed zero. And uh, yeah, feeling good. Don't have much else to say. Just uh, enjoying my peace and quiet out here. Making my way on this downhill, and then I'm going up that mountain, going down on the saddle, going back up our next peak. That that cloud's blown over. Oh, I just burnt my fucking hair. I can smell it. It smells like shit. Well, I got like nine or ten more miles left the road crossing to uh, <clears throat> the hostel of Maine and uh, it's gonna be near Stratton <sighs> and that'd be a total of like 21.7 for the day not really tripping on time uh, just taking my time because it's skinny little trail lots of roots and rocks I ate shit earlier. Um, yeah, I'm ready to rest and shower and laundry and I'm dirty as fuck. I haven't taken a zero since uh, New Hampshire border. New Hampshire, uh, Vermont border. Oh, fuck, I'm tired. Nice day though. Just did South Crocker, North Crocker. Well, I'm fucking gassed. Oh, I'd sleep right here if fucking rain wasn't coming in. Uh, it's fucking bugs. I'm exhausted. So I guess the main host, the hostel of Maine's like, all right, it's more money and there's no reviews on it. But the main roadhouse is apparently the new spot in Stratton. That is the, the spot to go to, the hostel to go to. Uh, I guess I go through the Begalos tomorrow. I got five miles downhill. I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna hitch in. I'm just really exhausted. I really hope I don't have Lyme or something. I think I'm just tired. <sighs> Fuck, I'm fucking spent. I haven't had zero since New Hampshire, Vermont border. Definitely feeling it. This is how it is a lot of days on a through hike. I got five miles downhill, hit the road crossing. I can get my thumb out, hitch to Stratton, 35 bucks, fucking Nero, and then 35 bucks, zero, 70 bucks. And I'm sure I'll spend another 50 to 100 fucking dollars on groceries just to go another three days. Rip my shorts, fucking bad today. Ate shit. Fuck my knee up. Uh. Yo, so I'm like a mile out. Fuck, I hurt my ears. Fuck you, mosquito. Hold on. What the fuck? 
fuck is that? Fucking spider. Acoustic. Fucking creepy crawlies down here in the valley. Fucking spider. Alright, yeah, so like a mile out from fucking Route 17. I uh, called the roadhouse the main fuck, the main roadhouse. And they do pick up and drop off, so said uh, I got five miles downhill I'll be down about an hour and a half she's like oh wow she's like it's a slow descent and I'm Acoustic. two minutes let's see there you go half a mile left and I'm fucking at 614 so I'll be like five minutes off but um yeah I'm gonna take a Nero zero hike out do seven more marathons wrap this bitch up and uh, go fucking home. Oh, anywho, 21.7 miles today. It's uh, 6 o'clock, 6 foot 14. Half a mile out. Gonna fucking rest. Every time I go into a shelter and I fall asleep, you're still hiking and you pass me. Huh?